Just a step, cried the sad man. Take a look down at the madman. Theater kings on silver wings fly beyond reason. From hey, YouTubers and Knife Nuts, New Jersey Devil Tactical, bring you another unboxing and first impression video here this evening. All right. Let's see what we got in the fucking box. Gonna be using my lone wolf to open this. Alright, see what the mailman has brought the dead. Alright. I gotta take this off screen here in a second. No paper and a knife. Oh, okay, I know what this is. Oh, damn. More plastic. Good having a sharp knife, ain't it, guys? Fucking slice and dice, baby. Alright, we got a CRKT. And let me read to you what it says. We have the K400BXP, the Onion Ripple 2, product of Taiwan. What the fuck, CRKT? Makes shit in USA. Ouch. Son of a bitch. Hold on, guys. I'm having a hell of a time here. What the fuck is with this thing? Son of a bitch. Fuck it. Oh, no wonder I'm not opening it right. Oh, well. And you got a little bit of, uh, you got a little book in here. Cool beans. On the book. More friggin' tape. Fuck, it's like I'm a, rook a rookie opening this fucking thing. Alright, look at this puppy. Uh, centered, centering's right down the middle. Nice. This flicks right out. Little blade play there. Big Dad will have to tighten that up. Yeah, I like that. That's a sweet color. Check it out, ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Let me put that on there right. All right, let me give you some specs on this puppy. Like I say, this is the CRKT Ken Onion Ripple 2 knife. This is the second calibration between the Cumberland River Knife and Tool and the Knife Maker Ken Onion. Uh, this is the smaller version of the original uh, Ripple knife and has a spectacular, nearly friction-free IKBS ball bearing system. So, Looking good. Um, let me give you some more specs. It is a manual folder. It's a drop point with a plain edge. The blade length is 2.75. The blade thickness, it doesn't say. Looks like about an eighth of an inch. Uh, uh, let's see. Blade material says ACUTO. A Curto and stainless Rockwell harness of 59 to 60. Uh, the open length is six and a half. Closed length, uh, closed length is three and three quarters. 
The weight is 2.3 ounces. You can remove the pocket clip and it is a frame lock. All right, and that's basically it. And I think this also comes in a serrated version, which I didn't get and I have no desire to want. So, man, I like the way that fucking blue is, man. That is fucking cool. It's like a snake skin. Let's see what it says on the blade. CRKT Ken Onion Designs. Um, the other side of the blade, nothing. Got a lanyard hole. Flow through construction. Some jimping on the back of the blade here and some jimping on the back of the handle. Which is nice. It's not over jumped. It's just jimped just enough. Um, pinky finger will not be on the knife, just on the very edge of the end. So, pocket clip, one way, right side, tip down carry only. And the pocket clip looks pretty good. Flips right out there. I am going to have to tighten the blade a little bit. There's a little bit of blade play there. So I'm going to have to fix that. Let's right, see how sharp it is, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty good. And then here's splitting sharp on a few times on the strop. And that baby will come up real nice. It is a hollow ground blade, comes up about a little over halfway, which I like here is the top's all rounded off, false edge on the top, nice up sweep. Yeah, I like that design, man. I like that cool blue. I like blue, blue nice, man. They're just really, really friggin' cool. It's like damn metal skin. Metal snake skin. So, all right, guys, I just want to bring you that unboxing and the first impression video of this knife. And I must say, it is a handsome looking knife. Really sharp looking. So, you guys are going to have to let me beat the shit out of this for a couple weeks to give you a full review. See how the blade stands up and, you know, see how the frame stands up and see how this thing holds up. So, all right, guys, if you have any comments or questions, you know where to leave them in the box. And I'll gladly answer those questions the best I can. So, as I always say, stay scary sharp out there, guys. And if you have one of these, tell me how yours is working out for you. Leave it in the box. All right. All right, let me get you a little close up here as I go out here. And we'll give you a little close up. Get you a better view. A little macro, I guess, what you would call it. A little macro. A little Big Mac. Alright, how's that, guys? Can you see that? I hope so. Alright. Alright, guys, so if you're anything you want to sell, tell me or anything like that, just let me know in the box. Alright, stay scary, stay scary sharp out there, guys. New Jersey Devil Tap, go out of here. I'll see you. Bye. Just a step, cried the sad man. Take a look down at the madman.